Preparation and confidence is so important in the sport of archery. Being able to spend time shooting the exact setup in very similar situations of either hunting or target related and knowing you're going to hit what you're aiming at adds this whole level of confidence and ultimately helps you perform better. They say it's impossible to be perfect. Noth nothing's perfect, but what you're doing as an archer is you're constantly trying to achieve this perfection over and over again. It's, it's not just like doing it once and then you're done. It's like, okay, you did it once and now you got to do it over and over again until the end of time, really. Like, we, we don't want to fall back on ourselves. We want this perfect shot, this perfect setup, and to stay with it and, and to do that. I mean, that is impossible, and that's why they say perfection is impossible. But here we are, and here I am shooting over and over again, chasing this perfection. And I think that's why so many of us are so intrigued and really in awe about this sport of archery because we're always trying to we're always trying to get better and since it is an individual sport it's only us that's the variable like we we can we can work we can educate we can try different things to keep you know getting closer to this perfection and i know for me that just drives me This summer, and this, this theme really of ASA is for me is just to have progress. It's been such a learning curve, it's been such a fun experience, and, and we're halfway. This is, this is the third tournament. We got three more to go after this. And all I'm asking for is progress. It's a little bit better each time, something more to learn from. And I'm really looking forward to what I'm gonna learn in Kentucky. everyone Kentucky ASA this is the fourth third third ASA of the year yeah third ASA of the year and uh, it's in London Kentucky I've been here a lot it's uh, it's got some challenges to it for sure the lighting conditions are super weird because we're shooting in this open power line into this deep thick timber um, and the leaves are all on now so it's gonna be pretty dark especially tomorrow morning but we got beautiful conditions it's gonna be like 70 degrees not a lot of wind right now. I don't think we're supposed to get any rain. So it's going to be a good weekend in the, in the weather aspect of it. So let's see how good of a weekend it is shooting. I'm excited. We're going to shoot some at the bags and uh, get right into it in about 45 minutes. Alright guys, well, end of day one. Um, like I talked about at the beginning, lighting situations were pretty tricky. Tomorrow, since it's early in the morning, early start time, 
we might get a little bit better lighting conditions like it'll take a while to get get 100 percent like brightness maybe if there's some overcast it would help but um we'll see everyone day two it's early gotta wake up very early this morning uh it's cold too it's about 59 degrees but i'm pretty excited should be good um lighting conditions i have no idea what they're gonna be like it's not a cloud in the sky so once the sun peeks out over the trees it might get interesting but looking forward to it another day of shooting asa london kentucky Now, the thing about ASA that's very different than other forms of target archery is the rings in the scoring system are not concentric. It's the 12 rings are not in the middle and the 10 rings are bigger and then the eight rings, you know, weird and then the whole body's a five. So we're aiming at kind of odd and weird spots. It's not like you have a dot to aim at. So with that, a, a big challenge that I've been trying to figure out is my sight picture using different lenses, different dots. So in my last month of practicing, I feel like I really found what works best for me. Do upper. All right, everyone. Well, I actually did super good today. Shot 18 up today. Uh, it was a super slow start, um, but once, so, once it got a little lighter out, we could see a little bit better, and I did really good. So 18 up today, 10 yesterday, 28 up for the weekend, and I only missed um, the shoot off by five points, which this is the best I've ever shot at an ASA, and every tournament this year, I've progressed like several points every single time, and every single time I like take something away and learn from it, so. It's like, it's a never ending learning process, especially for ASA for me. There's just so many variables and so many different things to learn. Um, and 112 can make it or break it. In this case, like 212s made it or break it. Um, but that's all right. Um, positive, happy, and ASA, Kentucky, we're out. <laughs>